Yes, everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome to a Dave's podcast show. I'm glad you joined this lovely day I call the podcast day of audio. This is audio. This is where we have to do with audio. Thank you for joining me. I'm not. I'm just going to delve into this topic I'm going to talk about. This topic I'm going to talk about is the rock singer of all rock singers in the world. He goes by the name of Kurt Cobain, better known as the group rock group, one half of the rock group Nirvana. Now, um, in case you're wondering, the whole entire case of the of Kirk Cobain shot himself. People thought he, uh, one person murdered him. To uh, they didn't get the autopsy reports. To many situations. Now, this is 26 years later since his passing. 26 years of the front singer of Nirvana, Kirk Cobain. Uh, the spouse was Courtney Love. If you know her, you would know she ties into this Kurt Cobain guy. Uh, 26 years later, can you believe it's been 26 years later in counting? Uh, 26 years later, didn't get an autopsy report. People thought he got murdered. Somebody murdered him. Um, to uh, act, uh, Just a lot of, lot of uh, loopholes out of this whole story about the way it was handled. Uh, Kurt Cobain died, did die, it says right on the Wikipedia pages, and search his name on any um, um, web browser, you'll come up with his name, uh, his uh, his music stuff, but most importantly, we're going to stay focused about him. He was 27 years old before he passed away. Kurt Cobain died in 94 of April 5th, ni uh, 94, age 27. Uh, folks, his spouse... They call him Spouse in these uh, web pages. Uh, spouse was Courtney Love. Uh, they had a daughter together. They had a daughter together. Courtney Love, who's no stranger to music industry, um, fell in love with the front guy of Novana. And Courtney Love's still around to this day. I really don't know her age, but at the time, she was a really young woman. Uh, I think she's older now. Much older in terms of age. You can look her up. Courtney Love is definitely live today. She hasn't passed away, haven't uh, passed away to the coronavirus or any of that virus that's going around these days. Um, I don't know that, but I'm just saying the person is still alive. How I know this, because there's been videos lately about her, uh, people take, keep tabs on Mr. Uh, the music artist to the um, Hollywood people. Uh, Kurt Cobain uh, spouse, well, married to Courtney Love. Now, Courtney Love, you people don't know, was no slouch of her. Uh, she had a, many interviews since that time. Since that time. Uh, many uh, interviews. Uh, she uh, At one point, she talked about the Kurt Cobain guy uh, that she was married to. Um, the guy, the front guy of uh, the band members, the uh, remaining band members of today, and that is the drummer, the bass guitarist, they're still around to this day. Both of them are still around to this day. Uh, the drummer uh, still went on to uh, be in a group called the Foo Fighters. Uh, Foo Fighters, if you know that rock group, you'll know that group, the drummer of that band. Um, he, he's playing gu guitaring, a little bit of drumming here and there if it's well if it's well needed. He's playing a little bit of guitar. He's a front guy of a group called Foo Fighters. The bass guitarist now I don't know his status at the moment, um, but yeah, uh, it was a legendary rock band early '80s and '90s called Nirvana, and a lot of it was a punk punk band, punk band nonetheless. They th uh, really thrashed out the songs, really thrashed out the songs. And Kurt Cobain had high volume of, uh, uh, as they say, in singing capability, a cabaret. Uh, had the high notes, reached the high notes, really screamed in the microphone, really hit the high notes on the songs. Uh, they did uh, unplugged stuff. They done unplug, MTV unplugged. And uh, yeah, to that point, it was great. It was great. But not until 94... The uh, there was a gun, uh, as you people would point out to be a gun nearby, Kirk Cobain. Now people thought that he was murdered. Uh, there was speculation that he was murdered. I don't buy who, but somebody speculating that someone murdered Kirk Cobain. This, uh, uh, the vicious. Twenty six years later, can you believe it? And count as I would say, uh, twenty six years. Can you believe it? Uh, Courtney Love. 
uh, Kurt Cobain married Kurt, uh, Courtney Love, and Courtney Love married into Kurt Cobain, uh, vice versa kind of thing. Uh, so they fell in love with each other like, uh, like you wouldn't believe. Uh, they had a, 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 a daughter. Apparently, I'm not going to mention the daughter here, but I've seen her on interviews, the daughter of uh, Kurt Cobain and Courtney Love. I've seen the daughter, well, many, many times on YouTube videos. Uh, she's uh, she's been on interviews talking about this Kurt Cobain to uh, uh, Courtney Love. Now I don't know her views on everything. Twenty six years later, can you believe this? Twenty six years later, we're still talking about this. Uh, and if you go on YouTube, there's been rehearsals footage of Kurt Cobain doing these songs, doing rehearsals. No uh, uh, audience members there. Just uh, just rehearsals. And uh, yeah. So yeah, 26 years later, doing your calculations, 26 years later. Courtney Love is still around to this day. She hasn't passed away. Uh, she's still around. She is very active, live today. We know that because we can check on uh, web, web browsers. Web browsers, we type in her name, we'll get a brief uh, information about her if she's still around to this day. Uh, uh, they say, in this day and age. Uh, but yeah, Courtney Love is still around to this day, <laughs> married into the front singer of Novana. Uh, and yes, they had a, a daughter together. They, they had a daughter together. Really, they did. Uh, there was photos about it. And uh, yeah, uh, Kurt Cobain uh, at the time didn't want to be want to be famous like any rock star. He didn't want to have that fame and fortune and be a rock star. He just wanted to be a normal guy, live out his life, and have a family and everything. That was his motivation. I knew his music was more important. Everybody liked his music, no question about it. But 26 years later, folks, this is 26 years late, April 5th, uh, 1994, 26 years later, uh, we're still talking about this. Still talking about this Kirk Cobain uh, thing. Uh, it happened, I think, near where he was living. Um, and Courtney Love was supposed there was rare photos of them being there. Uh, rare photos. Uh, 26 years later, there was rare photos never been seen by the public. Uh, other stuff was seen to the public, but these photos weren't seen to the public. It was rare. It was very much rare photos of them together. Uh, never been seen for the public, uh, that, uh, the public consumption could see. Uh, Courtney Love and Kurt Cobain were together at, at, at the day that Kurt Cobain passed away. Now, probably speculation that she, he was murdered. He, Kurt Cobain was murdered. We don't know that. We don't know that, but there's been speculations. A couple of webs, a couple of videos on YouTube were speculating that Kurt Cobain was murdered. Somebody shot him and probably wrote a little Lannister note. Anyway, folks, 26 years later, uh, I want to talk about, I wanted to talk about this in great depth and uh, there's no autopsy. I don't know if they did the autopsy. I really don't know if they did, uh, but yeah. Uh, people who are handling this, uh, the the uh, uh, the uh, whole case of the whole thing of Kurt Cobain passed uh, had a, you know I won't say the right gun that he used. Um, just you know anyway. So 26 years later, age 27, that he passed away. Age 27, some number I don't know why it has to be age 27, but it was. So yeah, Kurt Cobain passed away. Rest in peace, Kurt Cobain. If you're in this world today, if you're in the heavens, this one's for you, Kurt Cobain. There's some rare photos of you and uh, Courtney Love on rare photos. 26 years later. 26 years later. Can you believe it? Never been seen by the public. Uh, a few videos on YouTube were, sh uh, seen, uh, were shown that. Uh, but rare photos never been seen 26 years later. Uh, so here we are, 26 years later, we'll be talking about it as a, as a 30th anniversary. But yeah, until then, 26 or four more years, we'll be talking about Kurt Cobain's anniversary of his passing. Until then, I want to say, uh, yeah, Kurt Cobain and Courtney Love, I'll say both of them here on the titling of this podcast. It's very much, uh, we'll put the hashtag out there for you guys to notice where it's going to be. Uh, yeah, 26 year, uh, years later, 26 years later, I have it right in front of me. I had their names right in front of me as well, both of them. Uh, so the dr drummer went on to uh, Foo Fighters. The bass guitarist, I don't know where he is. Status, I don't know him, I don't know. Uh, 
But yeah, the the drummer went on to do other things, and that's pretty much it, folks. That's it. Anyway, see y'all. This is Dave's podcast, bit, uh, Dave's pod, audio podcast. Kurt Cobain, rest in peace in the heavens there, if you can hear me. Rest in peace, Kurt Cobain. Um, you married Cor uh, Courtney Love. Uh, you married into her, uh, the marriage thing, and you had a daughter together, Kurt Cobain. I just want to say that out there to the world. Uh, <clears throat> and I don't know what the uh, views on the daughter, but the whole thing of Courtney Love and uh, Kurt Cobain. I don't know what she said in interviews, but she said probably, I don't know, I don't know. Anyway, I have to uh, uh, just type in her name. She probably did interviews. Uh, 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 she probably did. Anyway. I wonder what she thinks of Kirk Cobain to uh, Courtney Love. Uh, but anyway, there you go, folks. Until then, see you all on the next podcast, Dave's Audio Podcast here. Thank you very much. Ciao for now.